Now, Redol, as we all know, have been uh, you know building large format and media distribution and delivery mm -hmm. platforms for a while. Things like MediaNet, RockNet, yep. and you know, Metron, which is their you know, Giga Switch thing. Mm -hmm. um, uh, and that's all great. This is a, a new product from them. This is called the STX200. And it's interesting to me because it's a deviation from that in yeah. that it pushes that media delivery into an IP platform. Yeah. So now you're no longer within the realms of you know your, your local fiber network. No. You're anywhere you've got an internet connection. Yeah, and uh, anywhere's the key. So basically what the STX200 does is it puts Skype uh, into the broadcast environment professionally. Mm. Uh, so you come into this you know, via IP, via a proprietary implementation of Skype running on uh, embedded Windows, and you can do things like remove the watermark. You, know, you get a reliable connection, it scales. Uh, and, you uh, get HD, got... SDI in and out, so you can mm. feed you know, your, your program into this so the person yeah. on the remote end will see. Mm. You've got balanced audio in and out, mm -hmm. you've got AES 67 yep. in and out. Um, and look, I, I, gotta, I gotta tell you, this is the new version, this is the production model. I got to play with the original one, which mm. is uh, two, two rack units a while ago, and I was blown away by the fact that I could dial into it I ran Skype on my phone mm. through 3G and uh, called into it. Uh, I had the box obviously connected to, to a network, mm. uh, but the phone was literally on 3G. Yep. And the quality is very good. You yep. can choose what output resolution you want. If it loses too much bandwidth, it can either scale the video back or it can drop to a still. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, you know, you've got a, a lot of switching options uh, for your external video, which don't exist on, I guess, the domestic grade version of mm. Skype. Uh, as you said, you can remove the watermark. There's a usage agreement that governs that. But yeah, look, I'm with you on it. It's exactly what they've done is they've made Skype in a mm. professional user interface. Yeah, now especially for applications like broadcast with so much current affairs reporting going from isolated areas of the like, only uplink they can get could be, you know, 3G off mm. an iPhone. Mm. This just makes it, you know, actually watchable for the for the viewer on the end. Yeah, and I guess if you take it to the other end of the scale and you've got another one of these at the other end mm. and you've got a decent connection between them, mm. then you're going to get some pretty amazing, um, you know, very wide area mm. vi video delivery options that just sort of, you know, previously weren't really a thing. Yeah, look, it's really good thinking from Riedel. Yeah, look, I, I, I'm with you on that. It's, it's definitely a very good piece of gear. Yeah. Now, thank you for watching. Uh, if you liked us, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button down there. And of course, share us with your friends. Thanks.